never reason with myself in your defense. Uh, hey, it is Helen at Carolina Rebellion, joined by Blake and Joy from Devour the Day, which we just recently, well, I mean, it feels like recently to me, because y'all, in December, y'all are in Wilmington, which is our neck of the woods, so kind of excited to see you again, or maybe someone who didn't make the show was able to check you out here, and you were talking about the crowd, and, and when you were playing, how was it? Like, it was huge, right? It was literally, like, in the double digits of thousands beyond what I thought it was going to be. <laughs> so it kind of freaked us out. Yeah. I mean, we were like, uh, I think it was just the fact that people are coming to support us. Yeah. Uh, and Blake and I feeling underdogish all the time. It like it's a like genuine a, moment on really stage. Really cool. We walked out. It was like there are people. Here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You could have one of those I've arrived moments. Yeah. Like, yeah. Well, yeah. Or, yeah. <laughs> So, and were they singing along too, like with Good Man and yes. Move On and Awesome? Louder than I was. Really? Louder than me. See that? I can't like imagine like being on stage and and having tens of thousands of people like singing back at you what you've helped create. I mean, Absolutely. it's well, got to be. There's two sides of it too. Like there's like, oh yeah, there's success. But then there's like the other thing is like, there's this many people who relate to what we're saying. That's yeah. incredible. That'll yeah. last. That'll be like a memory. Every time they drink a certain beer or, or smoke a certain whatever yeah they'll think of that song certain whatever it, right back, you know? <laughs> whether it's legal or not certain whatever <laughs> but that's but that's phenomenal so i'm glad today was you know amazing for you guys and i guess what if you know what's kind of your plans for rest of this year and i mean when when do you start thinking about new album or are you, is that something you're always doing or are you just living i feel like some people are always writing and then some people enjoy the process like just enjoy that one album and then like move on when they're ready like how what is it for y'all it's actually that's really good awareness it really is like that i think for blake and i we it's it can't be a forced time yeah. but we do write uh in between just when things happen or com like you know happen to slip away to a coffee shop have a great conversation and there comes a couple songs out of what we want to talk about spiritually or 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 lack thereof or whatever you know yeah the whole span of what we're trying to figure out, yeah. you know. So we kind of we kind of play all sides too, because right now we're kind of in a holding pattern with what we're trying to do uh, with the radio and the song "Respect," which um, is is really 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 great because it's a really aggressive song. And right now we're trying to put out as much new music as we can, uh, all while trying to write new music. You want to do good? You're doing phenomenal. <laughs> You're doing phenomenal. I don't, I don't know what to do with my hands. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Well, you could, I mean, you could if you wanted to. You could just hold Bob it. Barker. You could do the Bob Barker holding if you want to. Joey Walzer, come on down. Ooh, Ooh, what yes. game am I going to play? Oh, you're going to play this game. Moonshine. Dare. Oh, Helen's naughty, naughty bag. Dare. It's my bachelorette party. So these are dares. You can choose to do them if you wish. Pull one out. What does it say? Give me a lap dance. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, give it a lap dance. Yep. No, 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 no. Don't try to get out of it. Put it on me. Uh, wait. We need some music. We need some music. Oh, yeah. Back it up. Bachelor party. Bachelorette. Yeah. Coming to the main stage. He sits at six foot one. He's hot, dressed in black. Welcome, Candy. I mean, Blake. Whoa! Look at the big tits on Blake! Oh, wow, really? Oh, that is the Western reversal. I love it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, you're a music, music video vixen right now. Perfect. That was great. In my little super Yeah. Yeah. For real, though. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 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 That's not my first. Oh, is that your first? <laughs> Where? Yeah. Side profession. Yeah. And you've got the hair you can toss around. <laughs> 
to. I mean, be good. <laughs> Chip or Dale? Are you, you are you gonna make him draw one now? <laughs> Are you going to draw I'll, one I'll or go no? with Dale. Yeah, I'll be Chip. He can be Dale, and we'll just go on the road. Are you going to draw one? Oh, I'm, I'm scared of it now. No, no, no. All right, all right. Hopefully. <laughs> Give Helen a lap dance. <laughs> another one. Drip. Okay, another one. That's two left. Oh, blank. Doesn't have to do anything. <laughs> Helen's not a bad goose. Yes. If you were my wife... I would divorce you. <laughs> Very nice. So well, is that relationship there. advice? Just don't even do it. Yeah, get oh, out oh, while no, you can. No, 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 that's not my. I mean, my relationship advice is: if you are in love, enjoy it as long as that's still true. Does it? Is this? No, is I'm this for telling about a story? Is there some no, personal no, whole, aspect to this? Time and pressure. It tells the whole story. Yeah. Trust me. Because that. Because that told about like. Someone ended up in jail and etc. You want to tell this story? That's my fault. No? I told her to ask you that. Say what? You want to tell that story? About move on? Yeah. Um. Wait. Yes. Right? Is that what yes. you said? Well, because someone we were ended moonshining. up. Were you listening? You weren't even listening we were moonshining to me. And the cat how, can, came off. how can I ask questions if you don't listen to Here me? We go. Okay. About because someone ended up in jail, right? And then, t yeah, tell me this story, this detailed story. Oh, okay. Now that's yes. This is back in Pennsylvania. Yeah. Um, let's just get real. What happened yes. was, I we'd been sleeping in the van, um, yeah. night after night after night. Down by the river, and there's an opportunity. <laughs> the hanky pang where the bullfrogs uh, jump. I basically, one of the doors, security doors between two hotel rooms was open. Yeah. I put a credit card in there so that later at night I could slip into that empty room and sleep by myself. I did that. Yeah. I turned on some kind of sh TV show and then I fell asleep. While I was asleep over the course of the next hour, Blake and Jeff, also from Egypt Central, drank an entire case of beer and one by one went in there and set the beers on me. So. <laughs> When someone rented the room, the beer. <laughs> yeah, so I literally was drinking, crushing, yes. and laying them down, <laughs> watching Murder She Wrote, and uh, the is cop, that what it was really on? The, yes, and the cops came in. I didn't know they were cops, so I started punching everyone, <gasps> and they arrested me. And in the end, um, they made me sign a waiver that I would never come back to Johnstown, Pennsylvania, so and that's... I have not gone back. And that's the agreement. You and have to drive around it. yeah, really, have you ever had to literally? Really go around, around it, it. Because well, yeah, we're a little fearful of it because I feel like they'll bury me in a mountain it? somewhere. Oh, well, I went to jail for four days. I don't want to try oh, anything like well, that. That's yeah. true. Was that your first time going to jail? Personally? No. <laughs> what, what else have you got to jail? You got to tell these jail stories. Uh, no, let's just do one jail story each visit. Yeah. Just no. Next time you have us, we'll, we'll move on to. Okay, visit is done. I'm about to sneeze. Okay, look at right. the light. Look at the light. <laughs> It's done. All right, visit's done. Now another visit. Okay, another jail story. We're on our second visit. Um, <laughs> yes, it works like that. Yeah, yes. you can't make up rules. Nope. It's my weekend. One jail story <laughs> per uh, per visit. <laughs> well, thank you for sharing the one jail story, yes. and thank you for being a good sport. And uh, what? Thank humping you, for you? Yeah, thanks for letting him hump you. <laughs> thank you. Well, I'll ask my fiance for that. If that was okay. Later. Yeah. I'm sorry, guy. He just said no. Inappropriate sexual contact. I don't count that as inappropriate sexual contact. Well, not for that you. For, for Blake, it was totally it was inappropriate. It was. Yeah, yeah. It wasn't, it wasn't I mean, about understand if you got Blake's just a working color. girl. He's just a working girl. <laughs> <laughs> just trying to make my way through college. Yeah. <laughs> trying to raise 14 kids. I'm trying to pay my way through nursing school. Yeah, I'm going to be a beautician. I, I do, do know hair. people went to medical school, like from being a stripper. I mean, you make good money, I and who a, wants I, that bill? I have a friend that is a dentist. She is a legit dentist. And she paid her way while she had a kid. I know a girl yeah. who needs a dentist <laughs> and is stripping. <laughs> This is, uh, I feel like a plan's in Let's the world. Let's get them together. That is, that's all I've got. That's all I've got. I don't all even right. know where to take it there. Thank you so much. Thank you, I appreciate Thank you guys. Have a good one.